Hey guys, what's happening? Welcome down to a brand new vlog right here on Theme Park Insanity where today we are at Hall Park in Horsuff checking out Scott Pullen & Sons Fun Fairs. Now this is an annual fun fair that does come to the park here in Horsuff. We also get them in the local area too and you've got a great selection of rides including an absolutely fantastic gyro swing. Now this year there's due to be apparently another new ride so we'll get in there, have a little look around and obviously show you guys exactly what to expect. It is the fair's opening night so we're here for opening night and it's here until the 8th of May. One pound entry and then pay per ride. So without further ado, let's get inside and see exactly what they've got right here at Hall Park in Horsworth. So we're inside and we've got quite a varied selection including what looks to be an arcade so uh, a Roger and Tubi and Son Hollywood arcade so that's brand new lots of machines and stuff in there we'll be having a look at that later on uh, we've got Hooker Duck we've got your standard kids rides over here big inflatable bounty castle and slide and I want to say a massive thank you to um, the organizer of the fair for allowing us in for nothing basically I mean it's normally it's one pound per entry but he let me in for free so thank you so much for that I really appreciate that and obviously we're going to take a walk around before I do start getting on any rides show you guys exactly what's here mostly the same sort of uh, fun fair rides as there were last night I mean Infinity itself is absolutely incredible making that our first part of call very shortly indeed and uh, yeah we've got loads here including as I say uh, an arcade which is quite cool you've got a penalty shoe out there for the kids you've got this whole fun game so obviously you've got your standard fairground games there again can't wait to get back on that <laughs> uh, loads and loads of stuff you got a Miami there drop zone you got your waltzers you've also got your dodgems you got a lovely twister that twister's really good actually looking forward to getting back on that trampolines yeah, there's quite a lot here this year actually, it's good. Really, really good. you got a balloon race there. The runaway mine train which Phil really enjoyed last year. <laughs> yeah, absolutely brilliant. Right, there you go. That's a little bit of a look around. Let's go on some rides. We'll start out with Infinity right over there. Right there, that's where it's an absolutely perfect way to start our time here at the fun fair. Now, you get loads of air time, pretty decent cycles of all. It's by far one of the standout highlight uh, gyro swings traveling in the UK right now. Absolutely brilliant, it really, really is. And as I say, four pounds a ride, you get a great amount of time for your money as well. So, if you're gonna come here and you're gonna ride just one ride, make it infinity. So we've had a ride on Infinity. We're now going to check out the Hollywood Arcade and see what we've got in here. I don't remember this being here last year, if I'm honest. We've got these standard sort of penny machines that you would find at the uh, seaside there. 2P machines, you've got your claw machines over here. Quite cool. More penny machines, obviously little prizes and all that sort of thing. Very much kind of the sort of stuff you'd see at the seaside, but yeah, quite cool to be fair actually. More of them here. Great for the kids. I mean, the kids can come in here, the adults can go ride the rides, and kids can spend hours just playing on the machines effectively. Got jackpot machines back here as well. Remember those from when I was a kid, to be fair, actually, that's quite cool. There's loads of stuff in here. Got all your standard gambling machines here, so obviously for the older ones. Air hockey table. More penny slot machines there. Coronation Street. Got some old characters on there. Look at that. Good old Nozza. <laughs> and Becky as well. Wow. You've got a dance machine, the old dance machine, which I think Kelly's ready to have a go on. Yeah, we need some change here. Oh, we need to get some change, but yeah, we definitely need to go on that. Remember that from when I was a kid, so. Yeah, the old style one. Absolutely not. Not the, rub not the rubbish one, so we're going to have a go on that in a second. I'm sure I'll get humiliated, but there we are. You got more teddy machines and sort of claw machines there. Yeah, good little addition. Yeah. 
So how was the dance machine then? Yeah, very good. Is it I'm as good as you? Is it as good as you remembered it? No, not really. <laughs> you enjoyed it, though, didn't you? Yeah. Good. We're gonna go get some rides. Yeah. yeah let's go out then. Yeah. All right. So we've just done the dance machine. I'm nowhere near as fit as I thought I was. <laughs> Absolutely knackered. We're heading over to the Dodgers now, apparently. So we're gonna have a ride on them. And then I can see a really good twister that's calling my name alongside the uh, Infinity behind. I know, obviously, you know, I want to get on the bigger rides, but yeah, there's, there's quite a varied range here for everybody. It's quite good that they've got like, the smaller rides and then they've got the adult rides as well. It was quite busy a bit ago, but it seems to have died off a little bit now. So, uh, anyway, let's go get on the Dodgers. Alright, so Theo's going on the Dodgums with Mrs. TPI, so uh, I'm saying that. Oh, and they're off. <laughs> but they got a bit stuck by the looks of that. He's going in circles at the moment. How was that? Really bumpy. Yeah, bumpy. Kept getting bumped into. Yeah. You kept stopping as well. You kept bumping into all the cars, yeah. didn't you? <laughs> All oh, nice. oh, 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 oh. oh, right, Mrs. Chief guys, at your height of your driving. Well, I think I was letting him drive when he gets old enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I think I think twice as well. Oh, good fun little, uh, good fun little dodge jumps. You know, you get quite a long cycle. This is a good thing about these rides. Obviously, you get a lot longer than you ordinarily would on a theme park ride, and that's a good thing about fun fairs. Now you got your waltzes. They're not my sort of thing, to be fair. So I'm going to leave that one to me. I've also got a drop zone as well. I do love good Miami, but the only issue with Miami is they, are, they kind of tend to get a bit boring after a while. So I think I'll be giving drop zone a miss today. I can feel Infinity pulling me towards it like it's magnetic. I think I'm going to have to go on one more ride on that, I think, before I go into the Twister right there. This is Chief Guy just with me on camera. Yeah, let's go get back on Infinity. <laughs> Right, okay, I had a second go on Infinity. You can't blame me, it's such a great ride, it really is. But I'm gonna go on Twister now. I think Theo's gonna give it a go, aren't you, Theo? That's well, alright, well, if it gets too much, we'll ask him to stop it, but yeah, you can't be a good sizzler. Get on that, I'm going there. And then, uh, then we'll see what else is around before we start to wrap up this evening's vlog up. Here we go on Twist. You ready? Are you ready? Okay, I'm ready for the next one now. Slip me sweat if you want it. Come on. Woo! So, how was that then, Theo? That was absolutely great. You're getting really good with the uh, more intense I'm rides now, aren't I'm you? I'm going to go back on that. I'm going to um, go? Yeah, I'm going to get on that back. I'm back on that today. I've well, seen people enough money to do so. You've got to pay per ride, but in all fairness, three pound per rider, that ain't half bad. And it's good as well. It's a good long cycle. As I said, this is the thing about all these rides. You know, you get a decent amount of time on them. And it may only be a fairly small fun fair, but it's packed full of fun rides. Great stuff for the family. What more could you ask for? Okay, so after that little burst of energy on Twist, he decided to uh, go on something a bit more chilled and go on the uh, Bounty Castles. So it's three pounds, it's kids only, of course. All the usual rules. Three pound per person for five minutes. Not a bad do, to be fair, actually. And there's plenty to keep them all occupied while they're on there as well. They've got a big slide, they've got hoops. They've got like things they can climb up and feel demonstrating over there. 
you see quite a lot of these at the fun fairs around here but to be fair they are great for the kids and obviously no it's about the full family at the end of the day there we are okay so while Theo's on the bouncy cast off it we'd have a quick talk about the food that they've got here there's three different options from what we can see you've got your standard sweet stall over there sweet factory serving everything from cotton candy or candy floss as we call it here in the uk uh lollipops and all that good stuff sweets you've got your donut hut over here which serves all the same things waffles slush candy floss and of course donuts as well uh, i'll show you the prices in a second and then you've got a grill house that is serving hot dogs chips korean chips burgers cheeseburgers you name it prices don't look too bad we're looking roughly about sorry i do apologize <laughs> Uh, we're looking at roughly about sort of four pounds for a burger, so that ain't too bad. You got three pounds for a hot dog. You got your tea and coffee at two and three pound each. Usual sort of standard fair, fair, you know, sort of fairground prices. And in all honesty, that's good quality in terms of sort of value. You know, you can see them at a lot more than that. So there we go. Moving on over to the donut hut. So as I say, you got a selection here of sweets. You got lollies. We've got all that sort of thing. You've got marshmallows, flumps. You got buckets of candy floss and the sherbets there. You got your donuts as well, five pounds for four donuts. You have two pounds fifty for slushies, or large slush at four pounds. Lattes are not available from here. That's fine. You can get them from over there. And then finally, you have the sweet factory over here again, serving a very, very similar range of stuff to what was served over at the donut hut there as well. So obviously they've got all the sweets and stuff like that. You've got refillable slushies here, and also a soft serve ice cream machine there as well. Um, I'd assume that you probably have to pay somebody to serve you at the moment. Doesn't seem to be anybody here, but that's fine. I'm sure someone will come and serve you if you need to. And yeah, quite a lot of sort of sweet stuff for the kids. So make no mistake, if you're going to be buying things here, your kids are going to go home absolutely bouncing, <laughs> which they do anyway. So uh, yeah, perfect. Really good little offering. A little fun fact for you if you check out our vlog from last year's fair you'll see that i'm sat on a uh, sat on a little roller coaster with him that's your roller coaster right there and it is a good fun little uh, little coaster cred as well got quite a few laps on it great for the younger ones i think feels a little bit big for that now so uh yeah we will give it a miss this time around one last go in infinity yeah why not be rude not to wouldn't it <laughs> Third time and last time, let's go do this. Well, that's it for rides. Free rides on Infinity, absolutely brilliant ride. The hang time up the top of that is amazing. The air time as well, you kind of, you lift out of your seat. I swear that felt more intense than the third run, but such a great ride. And if you do love your gyro swings, then you need to get on Infinity, you really do. Absolutely cracking ride. And I think I probably said the same thing last year, but yeah, well worth checking out. We've done a ride on Twister, we've been on the Dodgems, done quite a lot to be honest actually it's been a really good sort of little uh, little trip out as a family really really enjoyable and you can't beat a good fun fair you really can it's, it's just it's nice to see them back out on the road once again hopefully at some point there'll be you know other ones in the local area and I think I'm back here on Sunday with Matt and Kelly as well so of course there will be a full vlog from that on the day can't wait to see Matt's reaction on that over there I really can't it's gonna be absolutely priceless but yeah I'll have a little bit of wander around now and then I'll wrap everything up outside <laughs> okay, so that concludes our time here at Scott Pullen and Sons Fun Fair at Hall Park in Horsworth. It's been a great time. We've got loads of rides, had a really good laugh. Overall, a great little family fun fair. Definitely worth checking out. And as I say, it is here until the 8th of May as well so all the way through coronation weekends if you are planning on coming down at the moment it is one pound per entry and then of course prices are per rider apart from the dodgems which is charged per car infinity of course the absolute highlight here if you love your thrill rides and you love your gyro swings that's the ride to get on twister really really good fun feel really enjoyed it and overall it's nice to see a perfect kind of balance for sort of family and you know sort of the older ones as well so overall a fantastic little fun fair and a massive shout out to all of you showmen right here bringing people fun 
good times and ultimately making family memories. That's what it's all about. And I really hope you've enjoyed this video. As ever, if you have, please consider hitting that subscribe button, turning on those notifications, and again, if you have, smash the like button and let me know. It's always really appreciated. But for now, I'm Joe. This is Theme Park Insanity, and I will see you all very soon indeed. Take care. Bye-bye.